Uh, we're inside the evidence room at uh, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service Law Enforcement Office in Springfield, Illinois. And as you can see, there are a number of pieces of evidence in this room, um, some that pertain to Operation Snowplow, uh, some that pertain to other investigations that are either completed or ongoing. We're continuing to conduct investigations that involve the interstate sale of endangered species. Um, you know, whether they, they're alive, carcasses, dead, whatever, these are, happen to be products that uh, were made from endangered species. Leopard skin coat, jaguar, tiger, leopard, uh, made into to everything from pillows. That's not fake? Nope. And, and coats, ocelot coat, to uh, rugs for display. We did an investigation on it. It was an, actually an internet investigation I did called deadzoo.com. Deadzoo.com was the name of an internet website uh, that openly advertised you know, a, a variety of different exotic animal skins, skulls, mounts, and so forth. Here's a snow leopard skin. Another jaguar. Still crusted. It's not even tanned yet. It's still a... They just dried it. This is the kind of stuff listed on there. You just buy it, he'd box it up, and ship it to you. During the covert investigation, we learned that McMaster had a second business, and this business was run by his father. Um, and uh, once we learned that, we, we had a covert officer make contact with uh, Kevin McMaster's dad in Pennsylvania and his dad helped facilitate the sale of a tiger skin to our covert agent. And I think we paid uh, $10,000 uh, or somewhere in that neighborhood for a tiger skin from McMaster and uh, his dad out of the Pennsylvania shop. He is currently been uh, charged and is awaiting uh, his day in court. But. You know, this is just one guy in one city that we happen to know about. Now, if you look across the country, how much more of this stuff is going on every day? Uh, I would venture to say quite a bit is going on in other parts of the country. To what magnitude, we really don't know, but I'm, I'm certain it's going on. The Internet's the same uh, for, for the live animal trade as well. I mean, you can go online today and punch in... Uh, any kind of species and you can figure out some place that you can buy it. You have live auctions uh, throughout the Midwest. I know we have several where you can go to any one of these auctions and it's a live auction and you can buy everything from a, uh, you know, a tiger cub to, uh, to a monkey to uh, ducks and geese and deer, you name it. Uh, you can just go and, and, and put a bid in in the ring just like, uh, like you would a routine auction.